Hey guys, um, I went to the thrift store today and I thought I would show you what I all got um, and then show you a few of my favorite thrift store finds and just share how I um, shop for clothes at the thrift stores. So I was able to get 11 items and the total cost was $40 today. Um, I needed some fall, um, fall clothes and then some lightweight um, things for the winter. I was looking through my closet and I have a lot of t-shirts and a lot of hoodies. I love hoodies. They're one of my favorite things, but it's still a little too warm most days to wear a hoodie around the house um, while chasing 10 kids. So I needed some, some lightweight stuff. So this is one of the shirts I got. I don't know if you can see it. Um, I'll go to the bathroom. Okay, so it's just like comes down a little past my elbows and um, back there. So little elastic around the pants or around the pants around the waist so love this one um, and it's one of my favorite colors so there's one of the shirts I got and then I got this sweater and all of these clothes were $3.99 or less and this sweater is from the loft and it has this cute little neckline wrap thingy so there is sweater number one the second sweater I got is from, it's just JCPenney brand, and it's elbow sleeve, and I thought it'd be really cute with a navy blue tee under it, because it's a little short for what I like, so I can wear, a, I have like a long um, navy blue tank top to go under that. The third sweater is from The Loft, um, and I used to shop at The Loft and spend a lot more than $3.99 for a sweater. So this is just like a basic teal sweater. Be cute with um, a pair of jeans. And then I got this one for church. And it's three-fourths length sleeve. It's Christopher and Banks. And it has some embroidered flowers on it. And then it ties down. And I wasn't for sure about this one, but when I tried it on, it was really, really super cute. So I think this might be a new favorite for church. This is probably the favorite shirt I got. It's see-through, so I'll have to wear um, a tank under it. But it's from Cato. We have a store called Cato um, in our town. And I normally don't shop there, but this shirt is like, like it's really cute. And it's longer on the back side. And then the sleeves are long and just black. And then just the different black stripes. This is a super cute, um, it's, it's lightweight, um, like sweatshirt material, but it's from Target. It's a Morona brand, and it's not a hood. It kind of looks like a hood, but it just folds over and is a little more feminine looking. So, and it's just it's between a like a pale green and a yellow color. So, love that one. This is just a basic tee, kind of from um, I think it was Old Navy. Yep, Old Navy. It has a hood, three cute little buttons, V neck. So. Be cute to wear a little color tank under it. And I just need some, some easy things for daycare. This is Eddie Bauer, and I've had these shirts in the past and absolutely love them. They're very expensive, so I was thrilled to find it for $3.99. But it's just got flowers along the bottom of it. This shirt was half off, so it was $1.50. And I've never heard of the brand. It's JJ... JJ Joe Fresh? I don't know. But it was just super cute on, comfortable, and easy to just throw on. This shirt was also $1.50, and this I actually bought to sell on eBay. It is Johnny B, which is Bowden's um, like preteen line, and I sold some other Bowden things uh, at Goodwill, or I have bought things at Goodwill from Bowden and then sold them on eBay, and I've done really good. Today I had another Bowdoin item end on eBay, and I made $20 off of it, so I thought I'd try selling it for, you know, a little bit, and if I don't make any money, then I only spent $1.50. It was worth a shot, I thought. So, there's that one. So that's everything I bought today. And then these are my favorite, some of my favorite Goodwill thrift store finds. I got this dress this summer, um... And I'm just going to pair it with a pair of black leggings. And it's just little elbow sleeves. But it was, I think, 2 or $3. And super cute. Fall colors. 
I need to wear that. I haven't worn that yet this fall. Maybe next Sunday I'll wear that to church. Okay, these capris. Sorry, let me excuse the messy bedroom. This is where everything lands. Okay, so these capris are G1 Summer Goods. And I never heard of them before. I bought it because they were super cute. I love the color of the inside of the cuff. And I came home and looked it up online. And these capris actually retail for like $120. And I got them for $4.99. So, super good deal there. And then these two pairs of jeans. These are silver tabs. And then Maurice's. I love Maurice's jeans. There again, sorry for the shot of the messy bedroom, I'm sure. But um, I got each of these for under $10. Um, I think I actually got them at the consignment store, not the thrift store. But silver jeans... They go, I think I've seen them for $70 in the store and up prices. And they're some of my favorite jeans. Super comfortable um, and everything. So those are my favorite um, Goodwill finds, thrift store consignment finds. And when I go to the thrift stores, I don't only look in my size, but I look in the size below and the size above. Because it's easy to get, you know, well, I don't want this shirt, I'm just going to hang it here. Today I found a lot of things mixed in the wrong sizes. And also brands just all run differently. Um, my favorite shirt, the black striped one with the long black sleeves, is actually two sizes bigger than what I normally wear. And it fit perfect. So, you know, you just never know. You know, somebody maybe washed it once and shrunk it really bad so then it didn't fit them. And now, you know, it'll fit you. But I look, um, you know, not only for things that are in my size, but then I make sure there's no stains, holes, rips, tears. They have all the buttons, the zipper works. I've gotten home several times and, oh, it's missing the zipper or, you know, there's a big stain or a big hole in it. So I try everything on because ours you can't really return to. Um, I also like the thrift stores that they're organized by size. There's some around us that are organized by color, and while that's great if you're going in and only need a green shirt, it's a pain if you're going in to shop for multiple clothes because then you're just sitting there shifting through, you know, I don't know, however many sizes they have. And so I really like it when they're all organized by size, especially when it comes to jeans and shorts because that's a pain to have to flip through all those different sizes and everything. But, um... I don't know, I tend to go there once a month or so just to look, and then I go there obviously if we need something um, in particular. But I found lots and lots of great deals at Goodwill and like with Salvation Army and the DAV store, so um, it's definitely kept us in fashionable clothes for a fraction of the cost. I mean, to get 40 items, or 40, I wish I had 40 items. To get 10 or 11, I guess I got 10 items for myself and then this one shirt to sell on eBay for $40. I mean, some of these clothes would have cost $40 just for the one shirt. So, it's like I got 9 or 10 things for free. But, um, that's where we do a lot of our shopping at. And, you know, it's great. I found Christmas gifts there. Shh, don't tell the kids. And, um, you know, other things. So, it's great. And... You know, it helps out the people, a lot of them have, you know, like the organizations that help the veterans or the disabled, um, you know, just different people that it also helps out and it saves on your budget and um, one-stop shopping. I mean, where else can you find all these brands inside one store? So leave a comment below with your greatest find at a thrift store or consignment shop. I'd love to hear about it and I'll talk with you guys later. Have a great night.